Well, the doctor said that, you know, you're stage four. They said, I hate telling you this. For our family, the normal was that we were waiting for him to have a heart attack. It wasn't a question of if, but when. There was just little signs there that I knew something wasn't right. We're harnessing the strategy of regenerative medicine by harnessing the patient's own healing powers from within. The oncologist reviewed the numbers on the screen, turned to me at the end and said, you have a malignancy. Today, a comprehensive guide for protecting ourselves from cervical cancer. My mission in life to keep my kids safe, healthy, and happy. And today we're gonna to give you the information you need to do the same for yours. Join us for this very special program as Access Health goes behind the mystery. We can't always protect our kids against environmental triggers like pollen and dust and chemicals, so what can we do? I'm Erica Vitrini in New York. Access Health starts now. We're in an exciting time. We're in a phase called precision medicine. Developments in instruments, imaging, and surgical techniques have improved the outcomes and feasibility of laparoscopic surgical procedures. This branch of medicine is now recognized as uh, the fourth pillar in cancer care. We have the diagnostic technology. We are learning new things about how this body works. And I noticed after a couple of treatments, all of a sudden he's up, anxious to go out and walk, and you know, my husband was back. Chelsea's test came back negative. A big relief to our entire family. I think there's a lot of power in bringing people together who have FH so that they can learn from each other. They just, they inspired me to, to maybe do that for the next person. You know, the Angelina Jolie effect, that instantaneously sparked conversations, understanding. I'm part of a study that's gonna help people in the future. I knew that this had an opportunity to be something really great for me and other people.